Oh, okay, it's 5.30 in the morning. We're going to go climb the Bora. It is May 4th, getting up the Bora. No snow yet, well a little bit of snow, but you know what I mean. The group is ahead of me right now. I gotta take a breather, take off some layers. It's big, it's steep. It's crazy. I gotta put crampons on. I'm starting to slide down the snow. No idea where the trail is. No idea where anybody else is. There's a group of five guys I'm supposed to be with. Sounds about right, sounds like a normal trip. The crampons make it pretty fast so you don't really slide backwards at all. Yeah. I've been making cheese and then taking it into New York to sell it at farmers markets. Yeah, farmers they pay big money for cheese in New York. It's about fifty bucks one way to get across that bridge. Yeah? Yeah. It's crazy. A car or what? Yeah, toll, car. Yeah. Yeah. Fifty bucks. Yeah. Wow. They might have even raise it. This uh, elevation is starting to get to me. Hard to breathe. Hard to talk. It's definitely killing brain cells because I'm still going up. <laughs> still making the ascent. What? We're still making the ascent. On your boot, now? Yeah. Early, dude. So Can we're going we up in? there? Yeah. yeah. Who's going first, you? Uh, either me Should or I Alec. Go. Okay. No, but Ooh, nice. These ones are a little jacked up. Are they? Yeah. That curve is okay, though. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's just. Yeah. 
this is Stick and Ridge. I guess, uh, hope so. <laughs> yeah. This is called Chicken Out Ridge. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. It's the snow. It's the fact that I had to climb back down and the sun's only getting hotter. The snow's gonna get a lot softer. Probably start sliding around a little bit. And uh, no way, no way. Like I do? Yeah. No, Joel. Oh. I got crampons on. Yeah, I think you can do it. If you have those, I don't think so, but if you have crampons, yeah. And then ice axe. No, he's what only got those crampons strap on things. things. The strap That's what he means when he says crampons. I wouldn't do the strap on. Yeah. Well, it's just coming back over it is gonna suck. It's it's the coming down that uh that's freaking me out. The snow's yeah, gonna be a lot softer. Down. That's what I'd worry about. Yeah. Yeah, I do not have the right crampons for this this style of alpine mountaineering. Uh, I hate being a pussy, but that's not going to get me to climb this mountain. <laughs> Call me whatever you want. I'm going to ski my bowl, hang out by the truck, maybe go to a hot spring. Be good. shake it climb down that hairy part yeah yeah I made the right call back in back it out still got some some gnar left but that vertical stuff is a little dicey when you're going backwards Time to go down, got my ski boots on. I'm gonna hit this line down to that bowl, stay to the right where the trees are, get into the trees, and then hike back down to the truck. I saw Dan and, and crew, I could see them actually from here. Hello! I don't know if they see me. But uh, they're doing well for themselves. They're going to make it. There's another team of uh, skiers, too, coming up the middle. That would probably have been a better ascent. <sighs> but what are you going to do? I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to go skiing.
Oh, 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 my, 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 <laughs> I climbed up the mountain twice looking for it. <laughs> it's supposed to be a ski trip, but like all my trips, nothing goes according to plan. But it's beautiful out here. It's about 60 degrees right now. So at the end of the day, this, this is what it's all about.